What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So we got some super exciting news in the world of jailbreaking today. Luca Tedesco has released a new jailbreak for iOS 10.1 and 10.1.1 for the iPhone 7 and the 7 Plus. So I'm super excited for this. It's basically going to be the same jailbreak as Yalu for 10.1 and 10.1.1. So much more stable than the mock portal so you won't be having those random reboots or random resprings or bad battery life or anything like that uh, like i've said in older videos for me the problem with the mock portal is getting the jailbreak to uh, basically be enabled that is the buggy part for me but this is still very exciting for me to finally have a stable jailbreak on the iphone 7 plus so if we go ahead and jump into safari uh, as you guys can see with Luca Tedesco's website here where you download his jailbreaks. I'm sure you guys have all seen this website. At the top, he has added a new section with a new IPA download. And the new jailbreak is called Extra Recipe, as you guys can see there. Uh, now, there's one downside to this, that this is pretty much beta 1 for this jailbreak. So, uh, he has recommended not to download and run it on your device as the jailbreak will not enable Substrate and it will not install Cydia. So for those of you that are super excited about this, don't go and uh, download and install it on your iPhone 7 or 7 Plus yet. Like I said, this is basically beta 1 and it's not fully ready uh, to be used you know, for the average person on their device. As I said, it will not uh, enable Substrate and it will not install Cydia. So we'll just have to wait you know, for him to release the next iteration of the jailbreak. Judging by his tweets, it should be pretty soon we'll go into twitter here check out his tweets so hopefully within maybe like a week or so we can see a new version of this jailbreak that will uh, enable substrate and install Cydia. Uh, as you guys can see with this tweet right here he says i do not suggest using the current release if you're currently jailbroken it's not actually remounting a uh, as r um, as rw and it doesn't run substrate so uh, he says it right there that you know you don't really want to use this jailbreak yet it's pretty much in beta 1, as I've said in this video, so don't go ahead and jump the gun, download it, and try to run it on your device at this point. I'll keep you guys up to date with future videos on this as we get more information, but still very exciting for everybody that's on the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus running iOS 10.1 and 10.1.1. We will soon have a very stable jailbreak to use on our device, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this update news. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.